Thank you for joining us tonight at 5 o'clock, everybody. I'm Bob Clausen. And I'm Ashley Kett. A high school senior excited to start his life has it cut short just days after graduation. 18-year-old Jody Loring was found shot to death. Happened early this morning. That's right. It was on Donaghy in Conway. KRK Force Chandley Painter met up with Jody's family and police to try to find out what happened. Chandley? This latest shooting is Conway's fourth homicide of the year, but police say this one has them working overtime trying to provide answers to this teenager's grieving family. Oh, man, he was glowing. He was glowing that day. His bright smile said it all. It was, he was so excited and so happy to finish this part of his life. 18-year-old Jody Loring graduate from Conway High School Sunday, celebrating with family, friends, and his three-month-old son. Sincere, this is Jody's. Now, just a few days later, his family could never have guessed the tragedy bringing them together once again. Today is a devastating day for us. And through the tears, they hope to shed some light on what happened. Yeah, we just want answers. We're talking to neighbors. We're talking to the people who were inside of the house at the time. Shortly before 1 a.m. Thursday morning, Conway police say Jody stepped out of his girlfriend's family home on the corner of Donaghy and Maryland across town from UCA. He was shot while getting into his car. Those inside the home say they heard multiple shots. I didn't know that he even had an enemy. Not a bad kid, not in any trouble. Now this close-knit family just hopes the shock of what happened in the dark will soon come to light. He was always smile every time you seen him, no matter what was going on. Kind of like Jody's smile. He loved everybody. The family is asking anyone with information on the death of Jody Loring to call the Conway Police Department. You can even send information anonymous, anonymously by texting the word CRIMES to 274-637. Back to you.